I like it too, baby. Welcome back to another MKX combo tutorial. My name is Darius P. And in this video, we using the bug saw variation of Kung Lao. Let's get right to it. We start off with the back three, two, one, AKA the heavy mount. Looks just like that. We got the pop up at the end. The slight juggle. Practice that. The back three, two, one. And after you get familiar with that, you ready to move on? Let's do this. Now, after the heavy mountain, we're going into the buzzsaw, which is back front two plus meter burn. It looks like that, but meter. And it won't seem like it's going that slow when we actually do it. Why is he tripping right now? Okay, there you go. <laughs> It won't seem that slow when we do it after the heavy mountain. So let's go ahead and practice that real quick. Now, after the buzz saw, we're going into a very simple side kick. <laughs> Front three. A very, very easy sidekick and I would say practice going from the buzz saw into the sidekick but he's gonna be in the air so well you can go you can press it anyway practice it anyway yeah. practice going practice pressing the buttons going from the buzz saw into the sidekick just so you can get a feeling of how everything is gonna flow so just practice that a couple times and then you ready to move on. I got blocking on just, just so I'll know what moves actually work and what moves are actually blockable. Anyways, let's keep it moving, baby. Now, after that easy sidekick, we want to hit him with the vortex, which is just the spin. I believe it's called spin. Let me look. Yeah, it's just a spin, but you add me to burn with it. Not the regular spin. Button meter burn. And let me turn block it, blocking off real quick. So I can practice going from the buzz so. off. So right now we want to practice going from the sidekick into the vortex. And you do press those immediately. The down front one. So it's front two, down front one. Plus meter burn. The down front one is plus meter burn. Remember that. Okay, so now let's practice going from the buzz out to the side kick to the vortex. Just like that, folks. And if he's doing all right. Okay, now let's practice going from the heavy mountain into the buzz out into the side kick, then into the vortex. Let's do this. Very, very easy. Let's keep it moving. Now, after the vortex, we want to hit him with a jump up punch. I use two myself, the two is Y or triangle. Not that one, but this one. I use the two myself, it just works for me. I mean, this is just what my fingers like doing. <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it, but it's just a jump punch. So we, well, we've already been practicing going from the vortex into the jump punch. So get yourself familiar with that. And then we want to practice going from the side kick into the vortex, then into the jump punch. Just like so. Practice that a couple times. Then we want to practice going from the buzz saw into the side kick, into the vortex, then into the jump up punch. Oh, why, why are we running, baby? Why are we running? Yeah. 
okay, now let's practice going from the heavy mountain into the buzzsaw, into the sidekick, into the vortex, then into the jump rope punch. Let's do this. Just like that, folks, let's practice that a couple more times and then we'll move to the end. Now, after the jump up punch, we're gonna hit him with a ve another very simple move, the flip kick. It's gonna look just like that. Well, not just like this because he's gonna be more out in front of us. That's why we're finishing that with the uh, flip kick because he's probably gonna be like right there somewhere. And we're gonna hit that flip kick and still kick him in the top of the dome. Okay, now let's practice going from the vortex to the jump up punch and then ending it off with the flip kick. Just like that, folks. It's just that easy. After you've done that a couple times after I miss it. You want to start practicing from the side kick to the vortex, to the jump up punch, then to the flip kick. You can actually start you a combo off right there if you can actually, if you can hit him with that. If you can hit him with that side kick, you can start you off a combo right there. Okay, now let's practice going from the buzz song down to everything. I don't know why I always say every single word, but <laughs> let's start off from the buzz off and go to the end. Now, if I turn black and on, that kick should not hit after that buzz saw. Let's just make sure. Yeah, he should block that. <laughs> okay, but now let's practice from the top, from the heavy mountain all the way to the flip kick. And that's the end of the combo. Let's do this. And there you have it, folks. 34% damage combo using two bars. It's more than his uh, X-ray, if I'm thinking right. But let's look at this one more time. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Share it with a friend. Thanks for watching.